Hey lovelies, welcome back to my channel. If you're new, hello, welcome. Hit subscribe while you're here and join in the fun. So today, as you can tell by the title, I'm sure, I am going to be trying out the Nikki Tutorials uh, collaboration with Beauty Bay that she's doing. Congratulations, Nikki. Um, yeah, so she's done a collaboration with Beauty Bay, obviously, of an eyeshadow palette. I'm going to take the plastic out of this because it's going to fall out otherwise. So we're going to be doing a review on this review, as always, um, and a tutorial using the palette. So if you want to see that, stick around. Okay, so I will show you the palette first of all. Too hard. There we go. So there we go. So one half is light sides, bright sides, and the other half is dark. Well, darker colours. Um, obviously, half and half. Um, so yeah, it is 30 euro, which I think is brilliant for how many? I mean, for a 12, 16, 20 shades for 30 euro. Unbelievable. Is my math for real cutting the grass now? I've literally told her I need to record this video. Okay, so before I was really interrupted by my mum cutting the grass, I literally had to go and give her daggers out the window to get her to stop, but she hasn't stopped. She's temporarily stopped, I would say. Um, so yeah, as I was saying, first impressions on the palette, I think it is very true to Nikki. I think, you know, the colours are perfect. Obviously, she does a variety of looks. So for her to have, like, a full neutrals or a full colourful palette wouldn't really be true to her I don't think so I think this palette is very true to Nikki um so yeah I'm not sure what colors I'm gonna go with today I'm wearing quite a neutral outfit and I am really loving the look of Mila I love a brown I just love a brown I'm creature habit but I also love bend and snap so I'm thinking maybe some browns with a pop a pop of color so I'm going to go in first of all with my P. Louise base and this is in the shade Rumour 01. I use this with all palettes and I've done my makeup the same as I always would. So I always think that's you know important when you're trying out a new product to give it a fair, fair trial by using everything that you would normally use. So yeah, that's why I'm going in with my P. Louise base. Another cute little thing that she has done is she's given this little card with a little message on it and then on the opposite side it has all the colours and what kind of brushes um, is best to use with them. Which I thought was really cute. Um, so yeah, we're going to get stuck in. I'm going to go in with the shade 5am. I also love the fact that one of these mirrors is magnetic on the palette and it's great. It's just great size for holding like this obviously to see with the magnetic mirror while you're doing your eyes so I'm going to use that and the other one is an average not an average, a normal mirror not magnified I'm just taking the Celsi by Kaylee um, SK02 and I'm going into 5am I don't know if you can even see that so I'm just going to pack that on on the outer corner I've been trying lately not to do my eyes my eye makeup I feel lately like well no not lately but before I realised it has been very rounded and I don't think it's doing a lot for me so I'm trying to change it up trying to teach myself not to have such a rounded make eye makeup look sorry I don't know if I'm making sense I feel like I'm rushing because I know she's going to turn that lawnmower back on <laughs> so yeah I'm just packing that on I'm not going to blend it out yeah I know it looks weird, but I mean, trust the process, as Nikki says herself. So yeah, just packing that on the outer corner. Then I'm taking a blank canvas, E3, E37, I'm going to go in with that shade, Mila. I'm just going to pack that on the side. 5am 
Oh, that is such a nice colour. Oh, I love it. Mmm. Yes. It's like a toffee. A toffee kind of a brown. Loving that. Loving that. Again, I'm just packing this on. I'm not blending it out yet. Big fan of that colour. I know it looks very messy, but I'll tidy it up. Oh, my arms are actually so sore from work. I had a mental two days from work this week. <laughs> and my arms are so sore <laughs> holding up this makeup palette. Oh my god. Yes, yeah, so I'm going to go in with the two brushes that I've used and just blend in between those colours and blend out the edges of them. Sorry if I'm blocking this. Don't think I am though. Yeah, no, I am like so far that made a colour. Oh my god, I can't get over the pain in my arms. Is um, like bomb duty. So it's 5am. I just feel I have other brands that are like 5am. I have nothing that is like Mila. And I am about the colour of it. Like it's just, oh, it's lovely. It's just lovely. A little taffy curly. Don't mind me. So yeah, I'm just going. I was going to go in and go full colour. But I thought no, I'm going to the shops, shopping after this with my mum. Um, so, I mean, I'm going for lunch, so I wanted to not be that fun out there. I'm saying that and I'm going to give myself a pink in her eye. So, yeah. Not really working. Just packing that back up, but I don't want to blend it out completely. Still want the colour to be there. I think my arms broke. Genuine. Going in between the two colours. Just to tie them together a bit. And I'm just going to get a clean brush. Uh, my Inglas 6SS. Just to blend out the edges a bit. And I've literally had no follow. Um, so far, don't want to jinx myself like, but been no follow. Thumbs up instead, of brush up instead of a thumbs up. Okay, so I'm gonna go in and get blend and snap on. I'm gonna try with this little um SKO tree by the So So Kaylee collection to take bend and snap. Just that pink color there. Is this gonna look a bit much? Like probably. I mean the pigment, I mean the pigment is everything but I mean did we expect anything less from the queen herself. I've actually never tried any of the Beauty Bay palettes and I've heard, I've always heard good things about them and if this one is anything to go by. I can confirm that they are literally unreal, unreal. I mean there's so many different um, looks you could create with this palette as well. Like I love 
plot twist. It's like a Tiffany blue. So nice. Um, I love Pride, this purpley um, shimmer colour. And I love Vla. Is that how you pronounce it? VLA. Probably butchering that. But yeah. And Redemption, I mean. We all know I love an orange warm. Uh, smoky eye with an orange and brown, but is that it's doing bits. They're all just fab. Like there's so many different looks over here giving myself pink eye, that's grand, isn't it? <laughs> but yeah, if you want me to do any more looks with this, just let me know in the comments. That is absolutely no problem. I'm just going in with a little bullet brush. This is again So Sue by Kaylee the SK04. And I'm taking that shade 5am to go underneath my eyes. Hang on actually, before I do that. I need a bit of eyeliner. So I'm going to go in with the Essence uh, ca Cajal, Cajal pencil. I can never say that right. In Teddy, I'm just going to put that into my lower uh, lash line. If you don't have this uh, liner, get on it. It is the bomb. Also, what are we thinking of my new intro on the videos? I am absolutely obsessed with it. I think it's so cute. She's done such a good job. I'll uh, leave her handle in the description box if anyone is looking for any illustrations or um, intros. I would highly recommend her. She's the sweetest girl. So that was just 5am and then I'm taking another bullet brush and going in with Mila. Just a soft the edge of that. Yeah, I love that colour. It's my favourite so far, that Mila. The pink is fab, obviously, as well. They all are. But I'm a bit obsessed with Mila. You can probably tell. I've said it about 100 times now. Okay, I am going to go off camera and do mascara and lashes and I will be right back to you. So we're back. I have stuck on lashes. Can I find my tweeze? Oh my god. I've stuck on tweezers. Not very well. I will add this one keeps popping up because I can't find my tweezers. So that's going well for me. So ignore that. Okay, so final review on the palette. Big fan, love it. Pigment is amazing, the colours are bomb, the payoff is really good. So yeah, I will link this down below. Um, I got it on Beauty Bay, obviously. Sorry, I'm just seeing it says makeup shamers uh, here. Uh, there, uh, it's a grave. I love that. Um, <laughs> sorry looking at the packaging yeah I'm not sure if it's still available but I will link it in any way for you hopefully it is and you can get your hands on it 30 euro definitely worth it I mean 20 shades and the payoff is bomb like I'm going to be able to create so many looks from this like so many so is there anything I don't like about it no not really there isn't so it's a recommendation from me and um, I hope you've enjoyed this video if you're still here leave me a little comment uh, subscribe hit the bell notification if you want to be notified when I upload and what else give it a little like while you're here and I will see you all in the next video hope you have a lovely morning afternoon even whatever it is wherever you are while you're watching this just hope you have a lovely day and I will see you all again soon bye